Hi, this is Tori for another Chapters Book Chat. Uh, today I want to tell you about The Light Between Worlds by Laura Weymouth. Um, this is a book that's technically classified as YA, but it's definitely a crossover title. I read it as an adult, thinking it was an adult book, and um, was perfectly enchanted by it. Um, it takes place in England, and it covers the very interesting question of if you end up going to Narnia or to whatever magical land, um, like so many children do in stories, and then come back to the real world. It takes place after these children have lived full years in um, in their Narnia type world. I believe it's called the or the Woodlands, um, and then in a flash they are right back to where they were five years ago, sitting in a bomb shelter in London. Uh, experiencing things as you know the 12 year olds that they were at the time but now they've lived years and how do you rectify which world is real and how do you overcome this absolute mind trick that's being played on you almost that you were living in this other world for years you're you're older inside than you are on the outside now and um, it's interspersed at the same time with really beautiful classic poetry, like um, think of uh, the poppies in Flanders Fields, that kind of very haunting, evocative um, language. Uh, it covers, or it's, um, there's three children all together, uh, two sisters and a brother, and this comes from the point of view of each of the sisters in turn. The older sister is better able to um, get back into real society, better able to put behind their years in the woodlands. The younger sister is not it was her home um it became her home and she is constantly searching for how to get back there and can't come to grips with the fact that maybe she can't or maybe whatever it was that happened it's not going to happen again um so it's it's really heartbreaking it's it's so beautiful and it's a piece of that story that I've never read before. I've never thought about what happened when they came back from Narnia and nothing has changed and they're right back, you know, no time has passed. They're, it's split seconds after they had disappeared and yeah, no, so I highly recommend The Light Between Worlds, Laura Weymouth. Um, just an absolutely gorgeous book and an absolutely breathtaking and spellbinding book. And I think you're gonna love it if you're someone who is into fantasy or really any of like the children's fantasy if you want that extra piece of the Narnia story um, this is definitely a book for you and <clears throat> like I said also then the classical poetry and the classical literature just has this extra poignant oomph to it when you're dealing with people who feel completely out of space and time so The Light Between Worlds, Laura Weymouth, this has been another Chapters Book Chat.